Hey everybody, so this is going to be January's Ipsy bag unboxing and I have it right here as you can see I already ripped into it last night but I haven't opened any of the products I just wanted to see what was inside. If you're not familiar with Ipsy I'll leave a link down below. It's a monthly beauty subscription service. It's only $10 a month which I think is a really great deal. I've been happy I would say like 85 to 90 percent of the time and I've had this subscription for about nine months now so it's been a really great deal in my opinion if you live in Canada shipping's a little bit more but if you live in the states it's only ten dollars so yeah check out the link below um and yeah I just got this in the mail yesterday I feel like every month it's coming a little bit later I don't know if that's the same for everyone but I mean we're today's the last day of January and I just got it and it's January's bag so I don't know what the deal like what that's about maybe it's a Canada thing but I used to get it more towards mid-month and every month it's been like a couple days later so anyways I'm just gonna jump right in and I open up this month's bag this is what the bag looks like pretty sure everybody got the same bag it's blue and it's got little cosmetic things on it not my favorite bag but anyways so opening it up there's five products inside the first thing is just the, well, it's got a funky scent to it actually, like plasticky scent, that's weird. Um, it's just the card that it comes with and it tells you about the products and there's codes on there and stuff like that. And then the first item I pull out is from Absolute, I'm guessing that's the company, it's Makeup Cleansing Tissues, Cucumber Extract, and there's 10 tissues in here. So we've gotten a number of different brands of makeup wipes before. I don't mind getting these, they aren't like the most exciting thing to get in the world, but I will use them, I do try them out. I just hope these ones are decent because I've gotten a few that were total duds. So hopefully these are interesting. Maybe I'll smell it. They smell really good, so that's a bonus. Like really, really good. So that's the first product. The next product I see, I was so excited about, like totally blown away. This is the Pore Fessional from Benefit. It's a sample, but this stuff is really expensive. I actually purchased a sample of my own. I wonder if I can show you mine. I think this one was, this is what I purchased. I feel like this was 12 dollars maybe a little bit more and that's just a little sample guy this is 0.25 ounces mind you a little bit does go a long way this one is how much it's even tinier it's 0.1 of an ounce so it looks like that this will still last a really decent amount of time like i said a little bit goes a long way and the full size of this is quite expensive and i can already give you a review on this it's one of my absolute favorite Primers. It primes your skin like any other primer, preps it, makes it easier to apply makeup, makes the makeup last longer. But the most amazing thing about this is that you can push it into your pores and it will somewhat seep into them and just kind of make them disappear. Not completely, but better than any primer I've ever used. And it's skin tone, so I feel like it just kind of helps in the evening out process. So I was so excited to see this. That's that's a great deal. That's probably like ten dollars worth of product right there. I don't know. I could be wrong, but I know it's expensive. All right, moving on. The next thing I see is in a little jar here. It's from Balanced Guru, and it's called Balm Me Up, Organic Sweet Cocoa and Tangy Body Balm. So I'm coming close so you can see it. That's what it looks like there. So I'm guessing it's like a body lotion. Really interesting looking. <laughs> it smells like very citrusy. I'm going to try and grab some. It's really hard, like, I don't really have any on my finger and I made a dent in it. You see what I mean? So I'll try and grab some, and it seems like it's quite greasy. Maybe I'll rub it on the back of my hand. Oh yeah, this stuff is, uh, is very greasy. Kind of similar to the Body Shop Body Butters, but even more greasy. I rubbed it all over the back of my hand, it left my hand quite shiny, so... I don't know, I'm going to keep an eye on this and see how it dries into the skin, see if it's really worth the moisturization, but I'm not a huge fan of the, the texture, the super greasiness. And I can usually handle, like, Body Shop Body Butters I like, but this, mm, I don't know, <laughs> we will see. Alright, the next product is from Malin and Gotez Mojito Lip Balm. And I would guess this is a full size, because this thing is ginormous, 0.35 ounces. Um, let's just open it up. It comes in a little squeeze tube. Put some on my finger. Oh, 
it's totally clear. That's what it looks like there. I'd put it on my lips right now, but I have one of those apocalypse things on my lips, so we sent to it. I don't know if I'm smelling the citrus from the body lotion or if, it, or if this is, it's mojito, so I'm guessing I'm smelling it. It's daily protection, soothing treatment, fatty acid absorption technology. So a lip balm, so that's interesting. And the last product I saw, I was actually really surprised. I don't think we've ever, I can say actually, we've never gotten any foundation in these bags before. And I got a Yabby Natural Finish Liquid Foundation Oil Free. And this thing is pretty big. Like that is a, that's going to last a number of uses. I've never heard of the company Yabby before though. Um, this is 0.272 of an ounce. And the color is buff. And I was super impressed that I think this is going to be like my color almost a perfect match. So I'm definitely gonna try it out. I like that it's oil free. I'm surprised that they're sending out foundation because I would imagine that would be quite difficult to color match everybody specific to their bag. So I don't know, I've seen a couple other people's um, unboxings of these. I haven't seen any foundation yet. So if you've got any foundation, let me know. I'm really curious what you, what you guys think of this. But that is it for this month's bag. I wouldn't say I'm overly, overly excited and I'm also not disappointed because there are two products that really make the bag for me. That being the foundations. I love trying out new foundations and I think that's great value right there. And the professional, that's amazing. I love that. I'm really excited about that. Um, the lip balm's nice to have. I mean, it's always nice to have a good lip balm. It's kind of like a whatever kind of thing. The body butter idea. I like the idea of getting a body butter, body lotion in my bag, but I don't think I'm a huge fan of this brand. And then the face wipes is just like, we often get face wipes. So I don't know. I would say I'm decently happy with this month's bag. I'm definitely not disappointed. So if you guys get Ipsy, let me know down in a comment below. What did you guys get in your bag and are you happy with it? What do you think of the products? And yeah, I think that's about it. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.